So as you know, there have been a number of FPV videos circling through TikTok, and especially those insane one takes. And well, for how cool that it looks, I wanted to get one, but they're insanely prone to crashing. And the batteries, they sometimes explode in your house. But DJI's new FPV system can auto brake, it can hover, and it even can return to home. So after a hard, hard week of consideration, I ended up going to the DJI website and just ordering myself a DJI FPV combo. Okay, it just arrived in the mail. I got about three hours left of sunlight left, so that gives me some time to get it charged. Oh baby, look at that. So here we have the drone. Oh my God, it feels a lot heavier than I thought it would be. And we have the goggles. Oh, these are so cool. These are so cool. We have the controller right here of propellers and just all the other stuff that comes with the box, like the cables. Now that I got everything unpacked, I'm going to take this thing to the park to test it out. All right, but before that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna download the DJI Virtual Fly app, and that is basically just a flight simulator, just so you don't destroy your drone the first time you fly it. Okay, so I have a map that I've chosen. Now, I'm just gonna go into free flight because I'm not, I kinda just wanna see how I do. Um, okay, let's go. So I know that you have to Turn these down and like this. Okay, so push throttle up. Okay. Oh, geez. Okay, okay. This thing is really fast. What the? F okay. I am going to fly in this simulator for a good hour before I go out and fly it for the first time. Um, okay, here we go. Already off the bat, I was starting to get the hang of it, but I was still very sloppy and sporadic, of course, when it came to making quick turns and adjustments, just like you saw. Oh, okay. But about 15 minutes in, I was starting to get considerably better at sharp turns and carvings. Look at this one I did. Wow, dude, this is so cool. I can tell why everyone gets so addicted to this. I was starting to get a lot more confident and I started carving and gliding down a lot more smoothly and just making it look a lot more cinematic. Okay, I'm gonna try to see if I can do this. This is so, oh my God, okay. Oh, I can already tell this is the wrong angle. Okay, oh, this is so fast. Oh, I'm doing it, I'm doing Oh my God, I'm doing it. I'm Dude! I started experimenting flying through small gaps in tight areas. And well... <laughs> oh man. <laughs> and I don't know how I managed to pull this off, but watch this. like really starting to get the hang of this <laughs> never mind never mind <sighs> okay all right that feel really weird taking that off i am now going to go to the park to fly this thing for the first time oh my god i'm so excited okay all right here we go here we go
I know, I'm gonna get an actual bag for this, but for right now, this'll do. Okay, let's go. Now, I'm sorry for the windy audio. I didn't bring my microphone, my shock mount broke. Uh, so I'm just waiting on a lavalier mic. But for the time being, I wrapped this inside a sweatshirt cause I was like, ah, I spent a thousand dollars on this drone. I don't think I wanna, I don't think I wanna break it. Let's get this thing all set up and let's start with the first flight. Okay, let's try this thing out now. I'm very scared, but just like in the simulator, go up. Motors are starting. Yo, this thing's fast. What? Look at this. Look at how fast it's going. Oh my God, this is exactly just like the simulator. My God, this thing, this thing is so nimble and fast. Look at how pretty everything is. I do have to say, things look very pretty. It is almost the summertime, so it is starting to get a little bit greener, but. This is absolutely nuts. Okay, I'm gonna try to do a little wrap around. Oh, that was smooth. Yeah, this, this is definitely worth it, guys, man. Like, just look at this. Like, it's so nimble. And it's just going. Man, this flies exactly like the simulator, guys. The battery is low, so I am going to go ahead and click the hold the home button. And as you can see, it finds its home. Sorry guys, if it scared the dog. Oh, <laughs> Perfect. There was people with a dog and I, I hope I didn't scare the dog, but. Well, I broke it. I, I didn't break it, but I kind of broke it. As you can see, on there, there's that little piece of electrical tape right there. Yeah, one of the little light covers broke. Um, if you can see in the video right here, I was trying to clear these trees, and I didn't make it in time, and oh, yeah, no, that, that, that hurts. Um, so there was only that little bit of damage to the drone, but a bit of my propellers kind of got chipped. As you can see right here, I'm not sure if I can get that good of an angle, but yeah, it's, uh, those ones are toast. I do have some spare propellers, thankfully. They're only about 15 bucks, so that's not that expensive. I'm pretty sure I can also get the light covers for about like two, three bucks. But I mean, that's the whole thing with FPV is you crash. Like it's, that's gonna happen. And with the uh, DJI coverage, I can actually get this thing replaced. All right, I am gonna go try to test this thing out a little bit more and see what I can do. I wanted to change the scenery, so I ended up going to a place called Pismo Beach, California because I knew it had a beautiful walkway and some bridges that I could possibly hit some gaps with. I didn't, but just enjoy the show.
Alright, this is the end of the video, but man, just look at that sunset behind me. What? What is this? What? What is this?